Hello everyone, my name is Jason, and I want to tell you about how important it is to always, 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 always stick up for yourself and defend yourself no matter what. No matter what the odds, no matter what advantages you're target you know has over you even in if you feel and think that it is insurmountable you cannot do it you still must stand your ground and fight because let's say that's true Okay, let's say you can't surmount this enemy, this target, this thing, this person, this whatever obstacle. And the consequences to that are forever lost for you, and whatever that will mean. So knowing that what the odds are, or what it looks like on the surface value, is favoring it. And even if that is true, that it is overwhelmingly against you, and you just go with that and surrender because it's, oh, there's no way I can do it. Well, you already lost, you already have been defeated, and they have already claimed victory on you. So, Knowing that, you have to go with that in those situations. And to me, the, uh, the answer is so obvious. It's so more than even black and white. What choice do you have? If you're going down, or someone, they're attempting to bring you down, don't peaceably just go easily so they can stay afloat and, and cast you aside. No. If you, if you are going to go down, why not inflict as much misery, damage, pain, and suffering back onto it in return for what is done to you? That's the least you, you should do, right? You know, it's very simple. You know, it's a very simple term. You know, if I go down, I'm taking you with me. Well, a lot of people say that. Not a lot of people really ever have the balls to follow it through. Because in that, that, that's, if you want to say, call that a philosophy or whatever, to me, it's a, it, it brings great joy and warms my heart in a way nothing else can when I'm going up against something or someone where I know I am inflicting negative, damaging energy and blows and moves and whatever back to the motherfucking thing that is my enemy. You know, so it's very simple, you know, like Boy, like down to physical attack. Bringing you, oh, please, there's no way I can beat you. Oh, just beat me up. You think you're gonna, they're gonna beat you up less? You think you're gonna lose less? You think you're gonna stick it in less because you, you let it go with no, kill me, do it nicely because I'm or something, you know? It's just, it's, it's, it's utterly wrong against nature, uh, I believe, to to sacrifice yourself so easily to something without, at the very minimum, doing as much damage to it as you can. You know, this is not over-aggression on my part. I, I don't see it at all. No, I see it, like I said before, m more clear than black and white. And very often, you know, 
at least in my case, the uh, my foes or my enemies and my targets. I can't say every time, you know, they had it coming. I would say most of the time, well, even most of the time, as I get older, it's more, I get more and more smarter, you know, into the ways of the world. But more importantly, I get more and more smarter into the ways this works. And I have to figure out this here. I didn't give a shit about that out there. Because when you can fully operate and manage this under any and all circumstances, against any and all comers, there's a certain type of strength that I find that accompanies that. And I'm more than addicted to that strength. You know, it, it's become a way of life for me. I have been climbing up a fucking hill ever since I was four years old. So life angers me, you know, a lot. But people mistake it. I know what they do. And I used to try and convince people otherwise. No, hey, I'm a good guy. I have good intentions. You know, I'm not this raving maniac, you know, tattooed psychopath that you think I am. If you bring that out in me, it's there. Absolutely. You know, but I don't fucking start shit. I don't ever start a war that I can recall about. Maybe a couple when I was younger, but it was stupid shit, but it's a little heavy for a Monday morning. <laughs>